Hey guys, hey! Welcome back to me sitting in my house trying food. Um, today we've got the McSpicy uh, Frank's Red Hot. Now I've never heard of Frank's Red Hot sauce, so I don't know what it's going to be like. And we also have the, I think it was Ruby, Ruby McFlurry, Kit Kat Ruby McFlurry, but it doesn't say it on the actual packaging. But... I thought I'd try both of them. They didn't have the pies, unfortunately, so I couldn't try the pie. But um, I did get the zero um, zero sugar oasis, <laughs> which is nice. Um, I'll start with obviously start with the Frank's Red Hot because I think I'm going to need the McFlurry because the spicy is normally too spicy for me. So. We'll just have to see. I'll put that there. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so that lettuce with the sauce on was hot. <laughs> All the lettuce is going on the floor. Right. This is what it looks like. Oh, so it's got cheese on it. It's got some jalapenos, I think they are. I don't want to open it because I feel like it's going to go all over the floor, but yeah, quite a lot of jalapenos on that and a floppy bit of cheese. It did take them ages to make this burger, so um, I just hope <laughs> it's worth it or not worth it because it's going to be red hot. Look at that cheese that's just hanging out. Right, are we ready? So the burgers, the actual burger itself is hot, like they always are, like spicy hot. So there's that. I don't think I've got any of the sauce yet. Yeah, so I got a bit of the sauce then. It's it's hot, but it's not any hotter than I don't. I don't think it's any hotter than it is when it's just spicy on its own. Yeah, it's got a kick to it. It's got a kick to it, but it doesn't taste any spicier than the normal spicy burger to me. It's good though. It is nice. The jalapeno is really add to it. The lettuce, mm, I'm not keen on this lettuce anyway. It's not, I've never liked these that this lettuce on these burgers. But, yeah, it's nice. Spicy, not too spicy for me. Yeah, so, definitely has a kick to it. Definitely spicy. If you can take spice. And I'm going <laughs> to just start coughing. Yeah, it's leaving like an afterburn now. <laughs> so maybe I did get that to the hot part. <clears throat> On that note, I'll try cooling my mouth down with some of this. So that's what that looks like. It's a, it's a strawberry sauce and biscuit. I thought this was Kit Kat. Maybe it is Kit Kat. We'll try it. Yeah, that burger, that burger is leaving an afterburn now. Hmm. I don't know what I think about that. I don't... Because <clears throat> it's, got, it's got the... Oh, I'm crying. <laughs> it's got the wafery bits from the Kit Kat, but... Because it's been in the ice cream, it's kind of crispy, but also a bit soft at the same time. I'm not really keen on things that are going soft. Hmm. Sauce is nice. <clears throat> as, as always, the ice cream's nice. Really helping with that burn. 
Hmm. Yeah, it's nice. I can't see the ruby chocolate though. Because I thought the chocolate was going to be like a kind of pink colour, but I'm not seeing it. So, hmm. that's a bit weird. But yeah, it is a nice a little addition for Valentine's Day. I don't know if the Red Hot is an addition for Valentine's Day, but I guess you guys might know. You can let me know. Um, anyway, <clears throat> that's my little uh, taste test of the spicy, which is actually burning my tongue a lot now. But definitely good. It is a good burger. I quite enjoy it. Probably would get it again, but um, yeah, it's got a burn to it now. But I think <clears throat> any more than normal, maybe, maybe not. Anyway, yeah, so <clears throat> I hope you enjoyed this little video. Um, let me know in the comments what you thought. If you've tried it, let me know. And I'll speak to you in my next video. Bye.